Hello, I'm Eugene with New Life Fit, and I'm excited to bring to you a particular talk that we pretty much recorded over um, several months ago. And this was a very special night with our family. Um, actually, every week we get our New Life Fit family, our New Life Fit clients together, and we just to encourage one another, just to empower one another. And we either talk about certain diseases or certain conditions, talk about the root cause, um, what's taking place why is this particular a disease or we know sometimes we talk about certain foods highlight different you know benefits of certain foods the power of foods we talk about different things hearing testimonies from different people sharing about you know how excited they are to go to the doctor and get their report back but this particular night was very special we talked about mental illness mental disease and it was very special because we heard of testimonials where you know pretty much what hope was it wasn't there there was no hope the situation wasn't good but God's grace and mercy how we seen in our um, new life fit family and some of their parents they seen certain conditions get reversed and several testimonies were shared but I really want to come to you today to share with you this particular food as it relates to mental illness. We always say at New Life Fit, there is hope. So diet plays a role and we like empowering people the power of the medicine foods of God. And once you learn about the power, once you get more knowledge and understanding how these foods can literally benefit our bodies, we have been um, taught, we have been um, been studying, even we have experience within ourselves and within our client base. When you know more, you, you know better, you do better. So therefore, you're empowered about these foods. You're more apt to try them. You're more apt to go to the grocery store and purchase them. And you're more apt to put them into your diet. So enjoy this particular talk about berries, how it relates to mental disease. Enjoy. Why? Why? Why are they so great? Um, so berries are loaded with an antioxidants, which a lot of us already know that, right? You've heard that before. They're loaded with antioxidants. So we're going to dig a little deeper than that, okay? Um, they're loaded with antioxidants, but there's one particular antioxidant that is very potent and potent and very... Um, um, prominent in berries, okay? And that's flavonoids, okay? And flavonoids are um, an antioxidant that protects the brain cells from oxidative damage, okay? And not only does it protect, but it also has been proven to actually reverse, okay? Um, and it also, um, berries also are loaded with what they call brain-derived, okay, keep going, brain-derived um, no neurotrophic um, factor. And that's basically what controls our um, mood, our like depression. If it's, if it's very low, what happens is um, a lot of people are diagnosed with depression, bipolar, schizophrenia. So those who are not eating berries, most of the time, and what studies have shown is that their BDNF um, is low. Okay. And what berries do is it increases that. So what they found is that those who increase berries into their diet, their depression went down, bipolar symptoms went down, even schizophrenia symptoms have gone down just by people eating more berries, guys. Berries, berries, berries. We cannot express that even more, okay? And they actually talk about, they say the king of antioxidant foods. Yeah. Um, yeah. Is that categorized? The king, that, that, that says a lot, right? But according to studies, the antioxidant in berries affect areas of the brain that are essential for intelligence. And they talk about a couple of studies here, and she's talking about reversing, mm -hmm. that helps with reducing DNA damage mm -hmm. um, and, and helps protect against aging. There's one study they did over 16,000 people found that blueberries and strawberries linked to delaying mental aging by two and a half years. Wow. wow. Amazing. Amazing. And it's amazing. Um, one other thing that I had um, 
picked up on blueberries that they were talking about is how it actually goes in and cleans the toxins, um, the bad protein toxins that are in your brain. It actually goes in and helps to clean it out, guys. So when you're talking about reversing, it goes in there and the damage that have already been done, it goes in there and it cleans it out, guys. Berries, 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 <laughs> berries. I know they say the darker the berry, you know, the better, but yeah. guess what? Eat your berries, any berries, get berries into your diet. It also, um, well, I already talked about how it increases the levels of the brain derived neurotrophic um, factor as well. Oh, and increases cognitive abilities. So that was one thing um, that we noticed um, as far as when studies come around, that it increases that, okay? Your memory, the learning, people's ability to actually, you know, function better, like be more active um, in their memory and their learning. Um, that was one of the things. And some, I um, also read a story about how, you know, with people with kids that have autism, how it actually helps out with that as well, because it goes in. And remember, we talked about the neurological damage that um, is, can be done, how the blueberries will go in there and clean it out. Well, actually, with um, autism, it shows how um, when they increase the berries, that it actually helped those who had autism to actually function better. Not to say that it cured it, but it actually helped them to function better. And if you ever know of anybody, which we do personally, um, know of anyone who has a child that is autistic, it really affects the family in a very, very, very big way. Um, but with that being said, that um, just to know that it can help with the symptoms, that makes a difference. You know, it makes a big, big difference. difference. Big difference. One study of nine adults with mild cognitive impairment consume blueberry juice after 12 weeks they experience improvement in the brain function it's amazing There's so many studies out there but we continue to see certain things goes on in the other industries but there is always hope never ever give up on anyone anyone you may have and people like oh they you know people trust me there's always hope because i know it's a struggle it's a challenge sometimes, you know, especially talking about the mind. You like, you know, you trying to go against somebody, you going back and forth, and it's like, okay, all right, all right, you win the day. Let's go to bed, and we we'll talk about it tomorrow. You know, it can be days like that because you talk about, you know, it, it can be very, very stressful and challenging. But I just want to give hope. We just want to give hope to to know that there is always hope, in spite of how many years they may be going through certain things. It can get better Absolutely. it can get better right absolutely so what are we going to do we're going to increase our berry intake um frozen again um it's probably the most economical but any way that you can get them in get them in guys our berries 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 are amazing for the brain wasn't that amazing i mean literally once you realize the power of food and how food can literally change our life it matters I remember he um, reading a study about the uh, the blue zones, the blue zone movement. How they went into grocery stores and they, you know, they 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 had a game plan with the management of this particular grocery store, this particular city, literally, and they change up the the products, you know, that it was marking, the products they was putting out front, and how they was literally having different signs up and telling them about the benefits of fruits and veggies. Do you know their fruits and veggies sales increase? about three times did you know they were selling out of produce the power of knowledge right so when you get information like this i mean you literally put this into practice and this is what we do at new life fit every week we educate there's there's, there's a difference between logging on youtube just watching a video and then being connected to a family where we are communicating with one another, where we growing with one another, while we are on the journey together. It's something said to be accountable to someone. And that's what we have at New Life Fit Family. It's very special being on a journey. So if you, you know, looking to, you know, gain some, um, that need some accountability, that want to be a part of a movement, I strongly recommend um, click on the link in our comment session. We will be very, very delighted to have you or even just to give you uh, give us a call to have a free consultation for 15 minutes. But needless to say, put berries into your diet every day.
That's one of our goals to try to put berries in our diet almost every single day. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you know anyone that have any kind of mental diseases or mental issues or a mental illness, share this video. They need to know the power of berries. More important, the power of eating a clean diet.